guys welcome back to the explicit seven my name is Haley. i'm your monday and this week our theme is embarrassing stories so um yeah a couple of disclaimers sorry that this is on my webcam today's just like a hectic day i'm back at school and i have like job interviews today so i just like couldn't slash didn't feel like setting up like my camera and everything and also like my roommates here so if you hear anything in the background that's what that is so yeah today we're gonna be talking about embarrassing stories and I don't really have like one large embarrassing story that like would take up a whole story time thing because I mean I'm sure I do I just can't really think of one so today I'm gonna talk about two that have happened in my life and this video is probably gonna be short because I just, I don't know you guys, so, yeah, um, so I'm gonna start with the first story, <coughs> excuse me, so this takes place freshman year, so this was like six years ago, I don't know, but this story is so fucking funny, like, I was just telling it to my roommate, and I was dying laughing telling it, but so, um, basically, we had this big, like research paper type of thing in history class it was my freshman history class and I don't exactly remember like what it was on but I remember it was about like Stalin and maybe like Marx or something but St it definitely had to do with Stalin and so I like turned in my paper and everything it was great I I was expecting to get a good grade on it and the day that the teacher was like handing them back she said to our class she was like um I don't think this is you guys is like best work on a paper it's okay I don't care <laughs> uh, the robe it was like an entity walking by I loved it. <laughs> that's, that's what I want, that's what I want to be. okay so um it was a day she was like handing back the paper and she said something about how like you know she was like a little disappointed in us you're gonna eat that with a fork? Oh yeah, okay. I was thinking, okay, I'm sorry. Do your video. I'm sorry. Okay, so she said to us, she's like, I don't know you guys, I don't think this is your best work. There were some crazy things that happened and she was like, somebody used a picture of Martin Luther King as Stalin in their, in their paper. And me and my best friend were like, that is literally so embarrassing. Like, how could anyone mix them up? And we were, like, laughing about it. And we're like, mm -hmm, whatever. And then the teacher fucking hands us back the papers. And I look on the front page of my paper. And it was me that put Martin Luther King as Joseph Stalin. And... It was really embarrassing. I mean, the good thing is, is that, like, not a lot of people knew that that was me, only really my teacher and my best friend. But, like, I honestly don't know what was going on. Like, I must have been delusional while writing that paper or something, because, like, obviously I know who Martin Luther King is, but something crazy happened along the way. But it was actually really funny, and I know it's not, like, that embarrassing, but it's pretty embarrassing, like, for your teacher like you're, everyone knows who Martin Luther King is like you don't mix him and Stalin up that's like pretty bad so yeah that was the first one and then the second story this was like eighth grade I want to say and so I don't know if you guys know about the website Wattpad but <laughs> Wattpad is, a, is like I don't know it's like an online like you write like books and it's mostly like fan fiction nowadays but Back in the day, Wattpad came out, and my group of girlfriends and I all thought we were published authors on that website. Like, we, every single one of us had, like, books that we were writing, and my book, I can't remember what it was called. I think it was called Love in High School. I'm pretty sure it was called Love in High School. But so there was this boy, and he was in the grade below me, and I was, like, in love with him. I was obsessed with him. He was so cute, and I wanted to date him so bad, but he was dating, like, the popular girl of the seventh grade, <laughs> and so, um, my Wattpad book, Love in High School, 
was completely 100% about me and him. Like, a thousand percent. It was me and him. It, like, I'm pretty sure his name was the same in the book as it was in real life. And, like, all of the characters were based off of real people. Like, his snotty girlfriend was in it. And also, she's, like, not one of my good friends, which is funny. But, like, I hated her in eighth grade. And so, it's, like, all of his friends, all of, like, my friends were characters. And they had, like, it was, like, their real names. And I never wanted anyone to find this, except for, obviously, like, my girlfriends. Like, we all read it. And it was so embarrassing, because it was, like, literally, like... It was, like, a fan fiction of me and this boy. <laughs> and so, one of my guy friends, who was, like, our best guy friend, somehow found all of our Wattpad stories. And he read my Wattpad story, and he knew that it was about this boy who was, you know, in the younger guy friend group that all of my guy friends were kind of close with. And my guy friend, who is a POS, showed the boy that I was in love with my story about me and him. And it was really embarrassing because, you know, I had a big crush on him and I wanted to date him. And then he found out that I was writing stories about the two of us in love on Wattpad, so yeah, not really that cute, um, luckily, you know, me and him worked together last summer, and he is still as cute as he was in seventh grade, but everything is okay, you know, I don't even know if he remembers, he probably does, um, he just doesn't bring it up because he's a nice guy, but yeah, that's it. That's all I'm doing today. I am so sorry that this is the shittiest video ever. I just really have no energy. Oh, also, sorry if there's a siren going on and however long that's been going on for. I don't know because I am... Um, I don't I don't notice sirens anymore. So, um, do you? Yeah, I don't notice them. This like, one wasn't that long. It just started this episode. Oh, it did? Okay. Because, like, I literally realized, like, I don't hear them for a while. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Check out my main channel and everything. I'll leave that all below. And yeah, I'll see you guys next week. Peace out.